Hello everyone, my name is Kumo and this is my reaction to the 6th episode of the 4th season of Senki's A Show Symphogear. Now, it's been a while since the last episode because this show isn't licensed so fan subs are really the only way you can watch it and fan subs are obviously much less reliable when it comes to consistency of releases than official ones because they just kind of do it on their own time. And the issue becomes even worse when only one subgroup is doing a show because there's no competition there. So, but you have to make do with what you have. So, I did rewatch the previous episode recently to refresh myself and took notes as I usually do. Now, last time, the power of the Philosopher's Stone that the alchemists have made their Ignite module pretty much useless against them. We got to see Kiriko's transformation sequence while she and Shirabe were doing some training. And they pretty much made it clear that they want to get to the point where they can use their sinful gear without the need of Linker. Which led into Elf 9 basically revealing a uh, direct feedback system that she was going to use to get into Maria's head in order to figure out the secret to making some Linker. So, which led to us seeing some of Maria's memories. Which was interesting. And yeah, that was pretty much the last episode. I think you even saw a little bit of Dr. Ver somewhere in Maria's head. Which is interesting. So, let's get into it. As usual, there will be no audio or footage of the anime used in the reaction for copyright reasons. There is a timer in the upper left hand corner and subs below me to help you follow along. And so, let us begin in 3, 2, 1, play. I'm pretty sure he did. But we're talking about memories here. I mean, I, at least I think he died. I really don't remember what happened to him, if I'm being totally honest. Man, I missed this opening. Just watched all the girls doing their own training. Well, aside from Kirika and Shirabe, who were just kind of running, I guess that counts as training. And back into the episode. <laughs> I forgot how weird he was. Yeah. I 
I know, right? Yeah, it was his research and everything. You must go deeper. <laughs> Meanwhile, in the real world, we get a Hibiki transformation, which I never get tired of watching. I just love watching the sweat fling off of her. <laughs> and of course, back to riding the rockets. Yeah. <laughs> just funny. Chris just gunning them down and Hibiki just punches them. Yeah, that big one could be quite the problem. <laughs> Just punch it really, really hard. with infinite rocket works. <laughs> yeah, of course it regenerates. Well, not exactly regenerate, but... That's not really the point, though, probably. <laughs> she just punched his head off. And just continues vomiting out more noise. How will it go for Subasa? Yeah, that's really a problem. <laughs> yeah, the bad guys are never considerate, are they?
Well, these are your memories. You've come a long way since then, though. Don't let it consume you, though. Out of all the characters, I like watching Hibiki fight the most. Just a straight up hand to hand combat. I guess you can't really call it that because the noise don't have hands, but. You get the idea. Yeah, the situation is not looking good. Hopefully Chris doesn't run out of rockets. Yeah, there's no end to them. Meanwhile, Mari is sinking, drowning. I mean, for a second I thought they were out of the machine. I bet you look even sadder if she was the one getting hit. Ouch.
Yeah, a kid with a broken leg still practicing shooting. And they both made it out safe and sound. <laughs> yeah, you're not going to outstrength Hibiki. <laughs> Miku. <laughs> so they are getting into the battle. Okay, now we get to see Shirabe transform. Man, it is not disappointing. Because in the last one with the training sequence, we only saw Kirika transform. <laughs> nice. Elf Nine's the MVP this time. Which would explain why Hibiki has such a high sync ratio.
<laughs> Empress Rebellion. Wow, straight up throwing fireballs. <laughs> what a way to phrase it. It's great to actually see the alchemist fighting, not just the noise. Look at they're about to kiss for a second there. <laughs> that shield's not gonna stop them. <laughs> Man, they went straight through. <laughs> PBK, you are so freaking cool. Yeah, more like six on three. So things are not going well for you guys. You still want to fight? And you call them arrogant. So they've clearly got some bold plans. So yeah, now that they have the ability to make more Linker, Mario's group should be much more useful to the team. And I love pretty much all the music in this series. So, that was the sixth episode of Senki's that shows Symphogear AXZ. Another great episode. Mario and Elf Nine are done playing around in Mario's head and they got into the fight turned the tables rather nicely took down the airship killed a bunch of Alcanois yeah it was a pretty 
a lot progressed pretty w nicely in this episode. So yeah, let me know what you thought of the anime. What you thought of my reaction in the comment section below. Hit the like button if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you in the next one. Have a good one.